I would not have shit figured out if I did not, if I wasn't a streamer, I'm gonna be honest, because I would, because growing up, I was really shy, like autistic as fuck, never had friends, never had a girlfriend, nothing, dude, and then, you know, I was gonna try and get it, like, I was going I was to college for finance, and I was like a line cook, so... All of my coworkers were Spanish, and I didn't speak fucking Spanish, and they were all, they all like made fun of me because uh, I was the only white boy in the kitchen. And you know, college it was I went to some like shit college that like older people went to because I, my grades were too shit to get into a, a normal college because I got straight F's in high school, so my social skills were pretty bad. And uh, yeah, no, I wouldn't really have shit figured out. It would take me a while to figure shit out, I think. But obviously, social media has made me, like, figure shit out a lot quicker, because I'm, you know, able to take in a lot of information real quick and experience a lot of things. No, drugs? No, drugs help me get more social. Drugs <laughs> never did shit for me to help me. No, drugs never helped me with shit. But, yeah, not everyone's path is the same. Like, I'm definitely blessed and feel lucky. Um, Spiritually, though, it's gotten worse. Like, I, I used to feel, like, more attached or something to the universe and karma and, like, all this sort of, like, weird shit. But I kind of don't really take m too much into account those things anymore. Because I see so many people and things that are just so many, so many bad people have it good. So it's like... I just kind of lost faith in a lot of, like, shit. You know what I mean? I just focus on, like, objective reality. And, you know, that's about it. <laughs> so, spiritually, it's pretty non-existent. Um, but, you know, maybe it's a test, right? A test from God. Maybe we're all being tested and I'm failing the test. Because, you know, faith... As it says in the Bible, faith is not is not needing of proof or something like you don't need like if you, like if you need proof then you have no faith like or type shit. So, but I, I you were born into like money. Kind of person, My though. point was that you think you're smarter than everyone else. You suffer from a severe case of Dunning Kruger effect. Money. You learn from nothing because you think you're smarter you know. than everyone else. You suffer from a severe case of Dunning Kruger effect. You learn from nothing because you think you know. Dunning Kruger effect. What is that? Hold on, let me see. I first of all, I don't think I'm smarter than everyone else. I mean, I don't know where you got that idea from. I uh, am just explaining my perspective and my experiences to people, and giving some advice to people that may need it. And if you don't need my my advice, then it's not, you know, directed at, it's not directed towards you then. It's directed towards somebody who may need the advice. The Donor Kruger effect is a cognitive, cognitive bias where people with low ability, expertise, or experience regarding a certain type of task tend to overestimate their ability or knowledge. Okay, so I'm over-exaggerating my, what, my intelligence? I mean, I just said I'm not very book smart, but you, I mean, you can't really deny that I'm not some kind of social smart. Like, I think I'm very smart socially, and, uh, so, like, maybe that's called, like, street smart or something, but... Like, I'm th I think I'm pretty street smart. <laughs> like, I know pretty quickly if, like, like what's going on around me. Like, I'm pretty aware. And I think the fact that some people don't think that I'm aware is, uh, you know, what makes me super good at what I do. I'm super aware.
I didn't get a new guy in my hotel 